it is my honor to ask Diego Santana Martinez to come up to the podium. Thank you. Alan Shepard, one of the original Mercury astronauts, was the first American to fly in space and one of only 12 humans who have walked on the moon. He was also an early director of the Astronauts Memorial Foundation. In his memory, the Space Foundation, NASA, and the Astronauts Memorial Foundation created the Alan Shepard Technology and Education Award, presented annually to a pre-K through 12 district or national level educator. The Shepard Award recognizes excellence in the development and application of technology in the classroom or to the professional development of teachers. The 2018 Alan Shepard Technology and Education Award is presented to STEM teacher Diego Martinez to honor his dedication to finding numerous opportunities for his students to learn about space, both inside and outside of the classroom. In addition to teaching at Oregon's Delphian School, Mr. Martinez collaborates with Space Foundation members, builds STEM resource websites, develops specialized workshops and challenges, and mentors students through several clubs, museums, and international schools. In recognition of his commitment to empowering students with science, technology, engineering, and math, the Space Foundation congratulates Diego Martinez, winner of the 2018 Alan Shepard Technology in Education Award. Thank you, Commander Collins. Thank you. Thank you, the Astronauts Memorial Foundation. It is a great honor to accept this award. I owe hundreds of thank yous to individuals in my life. They are all beautiful stars in my galaxy. My sister, Sahara. My brothers, Tasha and Caesar. Mom, Dad, thank you. One Star Cluster is the team from the Space Foundation. Thank you, Brian DeBates and staff for all your support. My space brother Daniel Neumeyer and I landed an RV at a Walmart parking lot to take full advantage of the Space Foundation's summer program. The professional development directly impacted Southern Colorado, and now nationally with Delphian Schools Outreach and Daniel's work at Space Center Houston. As a descendant of Ute Chief Ankatosh, I have to thank someone who I call Bright Star. That's my wife, Gail, who is also a teacher liaison and has been with me every step of the way. Her love and support made thousands of people cry after I told her about the award call from Laura Shepard. The video of that moment went viral. Now for my message about education. If we can routinely release the power of the atom, why can't we routinely release the power of students? I think the answer to that is in knowing the first principles of education. Currently, teachers are being tasked with the impossible keep 30 or more students learning the same thing at the same rate. This is the inefficiency of the century, and it's screaming for innovation. Having worked in the trenches with public school teachers for over a decade, I know the heartache and frustration. We instinctively know change is necessary, but is a breakthrough even possible? A great scientist, Nikola Tesla, once made breakthroughs in this very city. He inadvertently shut down a generator to the city with his artificial lightning while working on the wireless transmission of electrical power. Some of the greatest electrical experiments were done right here in Colorado Springs. Critics of Tesla couldn't comprehend that a device like an iPhone could even exist. Tesla understood the underlying principles and his predictions of a wireless world are all but here as thousands of satellites may soon interlink to provide broadband internet access to the entire world. It may appear that scientists like Tesla can, Tesla can predict the future, but it's really just about understanding underlying principles. Knowing these principles allows one to solve problems. And when one can solve problems, one can survive. Great empires and companies have turned to dust in the presence of poorly educated leaders. Education is important. I can't begin to describe the successes I've had teaching with the tools I've learned at the Delphian School. I originally used two of their innovative algebra courses when I worked as a public school teacher in the San Luis Valley. I eventually decided to work at Delphian after seeing some of the amazing results. The tools used there are a lot like Tesla's innovations. They are ahead of their time. 
I invite all of you to come see what is possible when first principles of education are applied. The future of mankind depends on what we're doing in education right now. Thank you.